Hi, my name is Justin Conway. Today I'm going to talk about text wraparound and what that means. Um, text wraparound is basically uh, what it's called when text reaches the end of the, the cell that you're working in, particularly in Excel. If it, if it reaches the end of that sort of border that's already temporarily set, um, then it will wrap to the next line. That's what, that's what the wrapping means. It's, that's what it's referring to. So the opposite would be if it was not wrapped, the text would just continue into the next cells. So if you have data in those cells, um, there would be, you know, it would be kind of jumbled. You typically would wrap the information, which would extend the cell, or maybe some of that text would be hidden. I'll show you how it works within Excel. So right here, I've just, uh, I typed a whole bunch of random letters. Um, it's produced in a string. So you can see this is not wrapped. It's all of the data lives in this cell A right here. Um, this is all the data up here. But it is actually um, just continuing through these cells. If you want to wrap this, you're going to right click on it and go to Format and Alignment and click on Wrap Text. <clears throat> and you'll see that it wrapped uh, to the end of the column length. So this is what wrapped cells means, basically. And uh, you can still shrink this column, and some of your text will just disappear. But at least the text is wrapped, and it's not continuing into neighboring cells. So that's basically wrapped text. My name is Justin Conway. I hope that helped.